Hi guys, welcome to this video. I am Prashant. I am the founder of Word Pandit and I am bringing this series of videos to you wherein I explain to you previous year CAT questions. Here we've got a CAT 2018 RC question and we are going to analyze it. Before we do that, I would request you to go through the passage analysis video, understand the main points of the passage, the gist of the passage and that's going to greatly help you understand this question. There is an additional reason why I am asking you to do that. For the simple reason, this is effectively a main idea question or this is a question which revolves around the primary purpose of the author and what is it that he's doing in the passage. The question asks you, it probes from you, the passage outlines several hypotheses and evidence related to white-lipped groups nails to arrive at the most convincing explanation for. So the author has given us several hypotheses and evidence related to white-lipped groups nails. Uh, why has he done so? What is it that he's trying to prove or arrive at? Now if you remember what the main or the primary content of the passage, the passage is about one thing, right? Effectively showcasing that how come these white-lipped groove snails, how come these are present in Ireland as well as the Pyrenees Mountains, right? So short form for Pyrenees Mountains, PM, Ireland and Pyrenees Mountains. And these are genetically similar snails, right? So there's no genetic variation between these two. How is How did that happen? So that is the question. The author gives us different theories. They might have evolved to, to uh, independently at the same time in a similar fashion in two different locations. Then he goes on to deny this. He gives another explanation, then goes on to deny it. Ultimately, he proves that human beings are the reason, are the cause and he explains that how human intervention has led to the transportation of these snails from the Pyrenees mountains to the to Ireland and how they coexist in both these places. Now let's look at the answer options. Option A, how the white-lipped variety of groove snails independently evolved in Ireland and the Pyrenees. He actually, actually goes on to disprove this. He proves this as something which did not happen. He says this is actually incorrect. This did not take place. Hence ruled out. Option B. How the white-lipped variety of groove snails might have migrated from the Pyrenees to Ireland. We'll keep this in consideration for now. Option number C. Why the white-lipped variety of groove snails are found only in Ireland and the Pyrenees. Again, another option that we'll keep in consideration. We'll keep both B and C in consideration. Option number D, why the white-lipped variety of groove snails were wiped out everywhere except in Ireland and Pyrenees. This is factually incorrect. They've not been wiped out, hence ruled out. Just the fact that the particular variety of white-lipped groove snails, which is found in Ireland and Pyrenees mountains, that is similar. Hence, these two are ruled out. Options A and D are ruled out. We've eliminated these two options. We are left with options B and C. Now, option number B, you have to be very, very careful. There are two issues with it. One, it says how the white-lipped variety of groove snails might have migrated from Pyrenees to Ireland. Option number C says why the white-lipped variety of groove snails are found in Ireland and the Pyrenees. So there is a very, very subtle difference here. The phrasing of option B actually implies that the passage is going to tell us how did the migration take place. The passage does not exactly tell us that how did that happen. It just implies that it could have happened this way A. Right. Second, this option says they migrated from the Pyrenees to the Ireland. Remember, the snails have not migrated from Pyrenees mountains to Ireland. They are present in both the locations. They were effectively, the author has implied, either advertently or inadvertently taken by human beings from the Pyrenees mountains to Ireland. And that's how they ended up at two places. Same, the similar species ended up at the two different locations. So that is what the author has implied. So they've not migrated that's incorrect. B, he's not told us how. Remember, he's just hypothetically said they might have gone inadvertently. They might have gone, uh, human beings might have taken them on purpose. He's not really given us that clear cut answer. Now, option number C, even though it uses the word why, if you read it carefully, this why is not giving you a reason. It just says why the white lipped variety of grew snails are found only in Ireland and the Pyrenees mountains. Now, if you ask yourself a question, what is the answer to this question? Why are these groups? cells found only in Ireland and the Pyrenees because they've been migrated with the help of humans. Because with the help of human intervention, uh, the white-lipped groove snails have ended up being in 
Ireland and Pyrenees. That's what the author of the passage has implied. And that is why option number C is the correct answer here. Is option C a greatly worded answer option? No, it's not. But from the answer options that we have, from the close answer options that we have, it's the best choice. Option number B commits a factual inaccuracy, so it cannot be the answer. Hence, option number C is the answer. We use the root of elimination to arrive at the correct answer. Hopefully so. You are clear with the reasoning for this question. Thank you very much for watching this video and as always, happy learning.